tells us less of a story, but it was more of an introduction of what's to come. Hey everyone, welcome to Operation KO, and today uh, we're about to see a new stories from the Outlands uh, called The Endorsement. So um, we're about to see this live, so this might be... Um, one of the new uh, additions to my um, uh, to the videos that I do. So yeah, uh, we're 14, 13 seconds in. Uh, let's jump right into it. Here we go. Well, I gotta hand it to you. You sure do know how to make a fine piece of hardware. <laughs> Looking good, uh, casual I think she made you Bangalore and Jibby. Wow, reckon we'll never find out. Better shot? Fancy Rampart? It's about to go down. <laughs> okay, they, they got a... Just troll <laughs> the rampart factory uh, sorry mate all closed down for the night okay now this is definitely going to be some action what a lovely pleasure i usually don't do a gauntlet round twice in one day but your eyes are just screaming desperation uh, don't even think about it. Right. Everyone got their clean knickers on? I know he does. Huh? <laughs> Get her! Alright. Okay, what gun was that? I didn't Where's see what gun sister? it was. Now, who's this mysterious... Lady? There we go. All right. <laughs> Burn it. Well, you put up one hell of a fight, kid. But it's you. Okay. Hey, this is the guy from the first. Apex trailer. Let's get you patched up. Okay, so that was it. I think we have to go through it one more time. Well. Okay, so we got uh, Bangalore and Gibraltar hanging out casually. It's good. I gotta hand it to you. You sure do know how to make a fine piece of hardware. Okay, so Bangalore is looking good in this animation. I like how she got animated in this story. It seems that they're talking about Rampart. <laughs> and she may even be a better shot than you. Fancy a go, Anita? There she is. So yeah, they're here. <laughs> They're here, they just showed us a close relationship that they have, Bangalore and Rampart. Every time, you're just too bad, <laughs> So we got the Rampart factory logo with the uh, flat line up front. So this uh, story is very short for it to tell more about Bangalore and Rampart. What this does is open more questions for more lore in the future. Right now it's asking the question who these people are, what do they need from Rampart, and why is she being attacked. Ah, what a lovely pleasure. I usually uh, The gun on the table, it looks like a havoc and she seems to be using it as a... Uh, so the gun on the table, it looks like a Havoc, and uh, she seems to be using it as a single fire. Don't do a gauntlet round twice in one day, but your eyes are just screaming desperately. Uh, don't. But I'm not sure. Think about it. <sighs> right. Everyone got the clip. So she got a tattoo on the back of her head. 
Let's see. She's firing the the gun with single fire. So. Where's big sister? She's asking where's big sister. So big sister is the next person in the frame. So we want to know who this person is. Uh, again, it asks more questions. So we might have Revenant Loba situation right here. She was called Big Sister. So it could be that this is like a faction or a fraternity or something. And this the Big Sister is the leader of that uh, group. So it seems like Rampart might be um, turning her back away from this group. And maybe that's why she's being attacked. Again, we're not sure. But here comes... So she got put down. We're not sure she got saved or if she was left alone. We're also not sure what those uh, people need from her and if they got what they want. So again, this opens more doors for questions for future stories. Let's get you benched up. Okay, and she got recruited as an Apex Legend. So uh, again, it was very short, tells us less of a story, but it was more of an introduction of what's to come. And this just makes things more interesting and more exciting for Apex Legends Season 6. So I'm excited to be able to um, get her in the first day of Season 6, check to see how she plays out. And also I'm excited about the Ball SMG that's about to come out. And um, yeah, we're excited to see and understand more about their story. So what do you guys think about today's stories from the Outlands? Do you have more questions like myself or does it answer some of your questions? Do you understand uh, what's going on? If you do, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, I'll be glad to hear your thoughts about this. I really didn't expect to see a new character coming in Season 6. I was expecting to see something related to Revenant and Loba. It seems that they slightly departed from that and moved to a more upbeat uh, tone for the story because Loba and Revenant story is a little bit hardcore. That was it for today's video. Again, please share your thoughts down in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching and you all have a great day.